today, uh, the Spanish appliance manufacturer Fago um, announced it enters administration. This news is very interesting in the industry, not only because Fago is one of the biggest European manufacturers, it ranks sixth in Western Europe and it's uh, the twelfth manufacturer by unit volume in Eastern Europe, but also because this news happens just uh, a month after the announcement of the joint venture with uh, the giant Chinese manufacturer Hyatt for the construction of uh, a new production plant in Poland. And this deal would also very likely mean that the two companies would join forces uh, for marketing in um, uh, Europe as well as in Asia. So it was a very interesting news for both companies, Chinese hire that could have a, a good uh, entry opportunity in Europe, but also for Fagor that could uh, perhaps revive its um, very troubled uh, sales. Um, entering the Asia market with a, a much more steady uh, foothold. Unfortunately, this uh, apparently won't happen, uh, but this is interesting nonetheless. Could this mean perhaps that Hire would think about uh, buying Fagor? Rumor has it in the industry that Hire has been looking for a good acquisition in Western Europe for a long time with no particular success. Um, this could represent a great opportunity. Uh, there were perhaps other opportunities before, but this is definitely one of the most interesting, not only because um, it's very likely that um, Fagor will be uh, more prone to be acquired, uh, but also because it is uh, such a big manufacturer uh, in Europe. Higher by buying Fagor would not only increase its uh, share of the European market, which is one of the most profitable, uh, but it would also acquire uh, crucial production facilities in the region because Fagor has facilities not only across Western Europe, but also in Eastern Europe and Morocco. So this is very interesting. Um, Hire indeed means business uh, in Europe. Uh, we know that. We know it has been trying to uh, penetrate uh, the market within the mid to high end of uh, the mar um, of the product segment. The problem is that it is a Chinese manufacturer and uh, still Chinese is synonymous of uh, low quality products in Europe, especially in such a market where there is such a competition coming from the local players, such as, for example, Electrolux, Bosch, uh, Bosch Siemens, Indesit, Whirlpool uh, and Fagor itself. Um, so this could uh, indeed uh, uh, mean a completely different scenario and um, and indeed could also mean that higher would have an advantage over its uh, other Asian um, competitors. We know that quite successfully both LG and Samsung managed to penetrate to enter the European market. Uh, this was uh, obviously much easier for them because uh, of the brand awareness they were enjoying coming from uh, the consumer electronics. So this is obviously still speculation in the industry, but indeed something to watch a bit closer in the future.